Some of you may remember me from my recent role as the dancing lady at the door. <laughs> Do you remember that? Ah, so for those of you that don't remember, let me refresh your memory. Hit it, guys. Oh. It, but several of you were part of, a, of an experiment. Ah. In terms of our topic today and talking about how to be fit for change, a big part of my role is to kind of shake people up, get you out of your comfort zone. And so what you saw me doing over near the door earlier this morning, that was part of an experiment because I wanted to see how HEB Pharmacy Partners would react to and respond to, there is a lady standing at the door early in the morning, and some of you made a point of letting me know what time it is, okay? You didn't say that it was a you know, certain time, you just basically said, it's really early in the morning, don't you think? <laughs> so I was you know, registering all of your comments and all of your reactions. So I want to be able to, first off the bat, to share some of what I have learned about this group in terms of what responses that I got. Now, I did have many people who decided, let me walk behind her. Maybe she won't notice me. And that's how you skirt it by. Some of you came in, you looked at me dancing, and quickly averted eye contact and walked very quickly away from me. I had two gentlemen that I just wanted to really shake up a bit. So as they came in the door, I walked in front of them and then they tried to go around me and I went. <laughs> and then they tried to go around me again and I said. And so finally I just gave up. I did have several people who joined me in dancing, which I thought was pretty cool. I had a lot of people who just looked at me and smiled. And then I also had one gentleman who walked past me and he said, you go. And I think I may have misinterpreted it. I think he meant, no, you go, <laughs> go. 